everybody. Death Hex Eagle here. Today we are starting a new series. We are in um, Medieval Engineers. We're going to try it out. Essentially kind of like Minecraft, but more kind of like, um, I guess you'd say adultage. Adult-ish. Adult I talk today. Um, you know, same premises, but, uh, a little bit more of an in-depth building system and uh, stuff. It's over on Steam. Uh, it's a sister game to Space Engineers. Um, they have the differences though. I don't know how to get started. We gotta find some rocks, some stones on the floor. There's one. There's a little pile of them. What else? Grab a tree. Harvest a small tree for branches. Ooh. Berry bush. Good for food. Nice we find some wheat too. One thing I do have to say about this game is the game is massive. Um, a world in this is massive. Um, I think there's some wheat right over there. Sweet. Um, so, let's look at the map here, just to show you. So this is the area map, where I'm at right now. I am in this region right here, on the planet. Just these two. So I can click on the middle here. This is a different area. The ends here are different areas. The tops is a different area with an actual like an arctic circle. Same thing with the bottom. This is its own area. This is its own area. Map is huge. It's one thing I love about this game. Ooh, we got some ore here. All right, so I think I might got enough stuff to start crafting things. What's up in here? Yep, I can start crafting the uh, stone axe. Pull that out here. And another thing that's really good about this game is the sounds. So if I go here and start chopping down this tree. If this falls on you, it will kill you. Well, it's falling. Go ahead and start chopping this up. This little engineer guy has some really deep pockets. Go ahead and remove the stump here. somewhere we want to build. The berry bush. And another berry bush. I like it. So are we gonna buy a road? Yeah. Should be a road right up here. Very bush. Now, one thing that is really interesting in the building system in this, uh, you can actually make mechanical machines. So, like, you know, you don't just like craft a treble shay in your inventory. You actually have to physically build one with timber and whatnot, and place the uh, mechanical parts in and whatnot. It's actually really interesting. Another thing that's cool that this game does is that you build stark, uh, stockpiles that you put wood and timber and ore and stuff in, and it actually your stockpiles will actually reflect 
how much the quantity you have in um, in your stockpile. I thought that was pretty cool. I got some cool over here. I'm gonna go grab that. No, it's not ready yet. Don't know what that is. Looks like some type of herbs. Alright. So, you know, I kind of like this area here. We got plenty of forest, we got these wide open fields that we could use for farming. There should be a road somewhere around here. Yep, yeah, there's a road here. Yeah. I like this spot. And this is where we're going to call home. Alright, so this is the build, like the block menu here. So, so far, the only thing I built are these two supports. That's it. What I have to do is I actually have to come up here to this tab here. This is your research tab. This is how you unlock new technology. You have military engineering, economic, and civilian. I normally like to go with civilian first. Because um, this unlocks you the ability to start uh, mining and getting better ores, as well as black unlocking housing. Let's start the quest for this here. Go to quest. Got to obtain those things and... So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna make a crafting table real quick. Treasure map. Journeyman's treasure. Ooh, oh, now you make those. Oh wait, what's this? Ooh, treasure map. Oh, that was a thing. Alright. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit three. It's gonna bring out the placing menu. I'm gonna place this here. And we're gonna put our logs in here so we can turn them into timber. Well, not all of our sticks. Okay, not all of our sticks. Only some of our sticks. And we're gonna build a bed real quick. And okay, what else we gonna make here? Oh, and the shovel. This whole purpose of why we were doing this. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and put these in our inventory. We will place the bed down that acts as my spawn point. And put the chest down for some extra storage. And let's go see if we can't find an ore spot. Still can't get over how pretty this game is. Ah, here we go. Go ahead and make small stones.
and it should allow me to grab the furnace. Go ahead and run back to base. disappear. Weird. That should be enough though. And we'll grab the furnace. Says there's some copper nearby, eh? Ooh, sorry, pardon me. Okay. We will place this furnace down. So they've marked an aura of me. I'm gonna guess it's that little pickaxe there. I need to move my bar around here. Put that up there. There we go. Ooh, look, a deer. Guess you can kill it. Let's see. Nope, I missed. The guy is getting hungry. Oh, here we go. This is tin. Copper. Hey, uh. So we're gonna start digging this out here. Three metal ingots. Some sticks, so let's gather up some sticks real quick. Sound, that's when you research the technology fully 
now you have open access to it. Gouse that so we're not wasting fuel. Alright. Not too bad of a start. Oops. Didn't even hit the table. Um, let's go ahead and build a timber and a log storage. Simply, we may have extra timbers and whatnot. I'll show you that real quick. So, I have these extra timbers in my inventory. I don't, I don't need to use them right now, and I want to store them instead of storing them in my inventory. So, you'd go over here to your timber storage. You can actually put these in here. So, there's two timbers in here now. You look here; it actually shows. And as this fills up, this there'll be more and more timbers in here. Same thing for the logs, which actually we need to go do some forestry. Um, here to uh, start getting wood, uh, a bunch of logs and timbers for us to do the um, basic wooden house. So we'll do that. Just love that. What I love about the game is how well that stuff is animated. We haven't even had a barbarian come and attack us yet. There are barbarians and bandits that will come and attack you randomly. Um, I think they might try to steal resources too. I'm not too sure on that. Such a pretty game. I would see this game multiplayer a lot more fun. As the guy who goes out and gathers all the wood, you have your crafter that builds the things, um, you have your, out, your miners out mining. I think it'd be a lot of fun. The game is multiplayer, so if you're wanting to play, um, join me in the Let's Play and whatnot. Uh, let me know in the comments below. You can, uh, Add me on Steam, and uh, you know when I'm on recording and playing, I'll let you know. And if you're free, you can jump down in, and we could uh, build a kingdom together. You know, you can saw I put a bunch of these logs in there, and now that is full of logs. Now, actually, if I remember, if I think, how do I do it? Is it no, not H? There's a way to. Options, controls. Not the controls I was looking for. Game. 
team. No. There is a way to grab hold the blocks. do that with there should be a way where I can like hook up a rope to this and kind of drag it along I think uh, not too sure uh, what was I gonna do oh timbers gonna make timbers over the rest of these here we're gonna make those into timbers Go ahead and make some salads. I might got a shout out on because he's getting hungry. Alright, now let's go ahead and start that um, other quest up for the basic wooden housing. We need to make a hammer. Oh, that's why. There we go. I was about to say, I'm not missing stuff with the hammer. But I was still trying to make timbers. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and make some planks as well. is going to be. And we're going to go ahead and attach some stairs to it. Timbers and four open sticks. Okay, what are the supports, eh? So this would be a fairly small little starting house. So we're probably gonna make it like a 
look like literally like four by four. I think. Right. So I think in this episode we'll build up to the point where we get the floor in, and in the next episode we'll actually finish finish the house. timbers or planks. comes the walls is the next step. So in the next episode we'll put the walls up and we'll get the roof in. Uh, I will kind of show you how to do roofing. Roofing is kind of really tricky in this game. Um, but yeah, if you like what you see, please hit that like button. Subscribe for more and leave questions, comments, concerns um, in the comments below. I'll try to answer them to my, the best of my uh, ability and whatnot. And we will see you guys next time here in Medieval Engineers.